guys, welcome back to my beauty stash or welcome if it is your first time here. Hello, my name is Steph. I would love to have you as a subscriber. So be sure to click on that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy watching. Today, I'm gonna be sharing with you what is currently in my Sephora shopping cart and some recommendations in case you're gonna be shopping the holiday sale. Now, if you are a Rouge member, you're going to be receiving 20% off throughout the duration of the sale. And that sale starts this Friday, November 5th, and it ends on November 15th. If you're a VIB member, you're gonna be receiving 15% off, and your days to shop are November 9th through November 15th. If you're an insider, you'll be getting 10% off, and your days to shop are November 11th through November 15th. The discount does apply in-store or online, and the code that you need to enter at checkout is yay holiday. I will have all of that information along with links to everything that I'm going to be discussing in the description box of this video. The links I include will be affiliate links. So if you end up shopping the sale by using one of my links, Thank you guys so much because it really does help me out to fund this channel. I'm excited guys. Let's dive into it. I'll be showing you pictures of everything I'm going to discuss. I'm going to go over what is currently in my shopping cart and then I'm going to give you guys some holiday set recommendations, some luxury recommendations, and some $25 and under recommendations. So if you guys want to know what I have my eyes on this holiday sale at Sephora, keep on watching. And guys, if you're wondering about the makeup that I'm wearing, I did film it. You should see this video go up after you watch this one. And it is using the new Game Beauty Harbinger eyeshadow palette. Game Beauty was kind enough to send me all four of their eyeshadow palettes. So super excited, super grateful. And this is the palette that I use to get this look. So definitely be on the lookout for this video. Now let's talk about what is currently in my Sephora shopping cart. Now now guys, my shopping cart right now totals over $600. There is no way that I can afford to buy everything that is in my shopping cart. I haven't decided yet what kind of budget I'm going to give myself, but it's definitely not going to be six, five, or $400. It's definitely going to be less than that. So the first thing I have in my cart is from Pat McGrath, and this is the Divine Blush Glow Trio. This is the lightest shade. I do have the darker palette, which I've really been enjoying, but this is the shade called Galactic Sun. The one that I have is called Amber, what is it called? Uh, Amber Allure. So I want to get the second one. I don't have any uh, Pat McGrath individual blushes, nor do I have any individual highlighters from her. And since I have been enjoying Amber Allure, I'm pretty sure I'll enjoy this one. Next is something from the brand Wishful, and this is Huda Beauty's uh, skincare brand. This is the Honey Whip Peptide and Collagen Moisturizer. This one retails for $43 and you get almost two ounces of product in here. I have never tried anything from the Wishful line. I've really been interested in trying the skincare brand. I believe they make neck masks. One of the things that I'm really gonna look for and I don't currently have it in my cart is a neck cream. I need to start, at least I feel I need to start using a neck cream. I'm 39 years old, so I wanna start combating those lines that we get right here. What do they call it? Tech neck, since we're always looking down at our phone. So I need to add a neck cream to my cart. But this Wishful Moisturizer sounded interesting and since I haven't tried the brand and I have been finishing up some of my moisturizers, I might give this one a shot. Next on my list are eyeliners and these are from ABH, the Norvina line. This is the uh, Chroma Stick Makeup Pencils and each of them retail for $18, which I think that's a hefty price tag for eyeliner, especially because I have a lot of favorites at the drugstore that are definitely $10 or less. Um, I have in my cart the shade Electric Blue, and I also have the shade Violet. I think if I pick up one, I think it's gonna be Violet. I'm always on the hunt for a good purple eyeliner. I'm really attracted to all of the colors that she came out with, and I think this was a good addition to to the Norvina line. So I might, I might pick up at least one, if not both. We'll see what kind of mood I am on Friday. Next up is from the Inky List. And this is a product that I've already used a few times uh, before and I love it. 
This is the retinol anti-aging serum. This does not cause any irritation on my normal to oily skin. This is a really nice retinol, especially if you're new to retinol. I would highly recommend checking this one out. It is only 10 bucks. You do get one ounce of product and this has been great for me. I've really enjoyed it. Next on my list is from the brand Biosense and I hope I pronounced that right. I have been wanting to try this brand for a while. I've had my eye on them for a while. I've heard amazing things about this squalene and zinc sheer mineral sunscreen SPF 30. My friend Bridget here on YouTube, she loves the sunscreen. So hi Bridget, if you're watching, I'll have her channel linked down below. Bridget knows a lot about skincare and she does amazing makeup. So definitely check her out, send her some love, tell her Steph sent you, but she really enjoys the sunscreen. I like that it's a mineral sunscreen because I don't think I have any mineral sunscreens in my stash. It retails for $42. You do get 3.38 ounces of product so I might I need to check where I'm at on the other sunscreens that I have because uh, sunscreen does have an expiration date and you need to be mindful of that expiration date um, because if you're using an expired sunscreen it's just not going to be effective so if I'm close to finishing up some of my other sunscreens then I will more than likely be picking this one up next in my cart is something from Fenty skin I get so many emails I signed up for the emails for Fenty Beauty and of course Fenty skin every day they send me like one or two emails and I always get something from Fenty skin and everything just looks so good I just don't really know where to start um, I've heard a lot of good things though about this fat water pore refining toner serum with niacinamide you do get five ounces in here and it retails for $28. I think $28 is a pretty fair price point given that this is Fenty and for the amount of product that you're getting. I, I might be checking this one out. I am almost done with a couple of my toners, so this would be a nice replacement and it's just something that I've been wanting to try for a while. Also in my cart is something I just recently added and this is because I've been using this product the last couple days and it is the Danessa Myrix Vision Cream Cover Adjustable Foundation and concealer. I used this foundation in my last two videos and I used it because I had a sample of it. I'm looking here on my desk, which I have not cleaned, but um, I don't see it anywhere in sight. But I used the shade three. I think I want to try the shade 2.75 because I felt shade three was just a smidge too dark. It retails for $22. Now, I think you only get like 0.5 ounces of product it's not like your traditional foundation size. It could even be less than 0.5, but I really liked the way it wore for those videos. And in one of the videos, I wore that product for at least 10 hours and it did great. You guys know I loved the Danessa Myricks Lightwork Volume 3 palette. Remember, there is a giveaway on that video. So if you haven't entered my giveaway, please go check out that video. I'll have it linked up above. Um, that way you can enter and win the mini Lightwork Volume 3 palette that I am giving away. But yeah, this product might be coming home with me on Friday. Another item I've had on my loves list for a while now, both here at Sephora and at Ulta. This is from First Aid Beauty and this is the Ultra Repair Wild Oat Hydrating Toner. This retails for $24. You get six ounces of product, so it is cheaper than the Fenty and you do get one ounce more. Um, they're different though. This one is not going to have... Um, um, niacinamide and the other one is going to be more of a pore refining toner the Fenty one versus this one which is going to be more of a hydrating toner so I'm actually might end up picking them both up I've been really into toners and essences lately and I know I am about to finish up at least two of the ones I have an essence and a toner so it would make complete sense for me to pick them both up right Next on my list is something I've been telling you I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy, and it is the Rare Beauty Mascara. This is the Perfect Strokes Universal Volumizing Mascara. I have the mini size. I have it right now in my purse. I apply that usually when I get to work, and I've used it for the last two weeks straight. I didn't use it today because I took it out of my purse and it's probably here on my desk underneath everything and I can't find it. But uh, this is a fairly reasonable price point, 20 bucks for a uh, you know makeup brand at Sephora. I think it's on the cheaper price points versus other mascaras that you can find at, um, at Sephora and at Ulta. 
and it does an amazing job. Like if you're looking to add a new mascara to your stash, I'd highly recommend checking this one out. I think they did a beautiful job with it. It lengthens, it volumizes, it doesn't smear, flake, smudge. It just stays on until you're ready to take it off. And I think this could be the best rare beauty product that I have ever tried. Next on my list is from the Inky List. And if you're noticing that my shopping cart seems a little skincare heavy, that's because I usually go for skincare. Skincare is usually more expensive than than makeup and I like to get it on sale when I can so I usually tend to stock up during these Sephora sales this one is super cheap this is four dollars and 49 cents because it's the mini size of the oat cleansing balm I've heard good things about this one you do get 1.7 ounces of product I mean for less than five bucks uh, I'm willing to pay that in order to try it to see if it's something that I do like and to see if my skin reacts well to it next is from Charlotte Tilbury now I have some Charlotte Tilbury products in my stash as far as makeup goes. Um, I think I find myself enjoying her skincare and her base products more than I do like the eyeshadow or anything like that. Um, I've said it before, I'm not a huge fan of her eyeshadows. I think they're really overpriced for what they are. But this mini airbrush flawless setting spray duo, I have already used up one of these setting sprays and I enjoyed it. I kept it here um, on my filming desk here you're getting two for 29 I think this is a really nice gift set um, to pick up maybe you keep one and then give one as a little stocking stuffer or something but I had a really good experience with this so I'm definitely going to be buying these next is another rare beauty product and this is a mini set these are all things that I have not tried yet from the brand. So this is Selena's Faves four piece mini set. It does retail for $30. So actually is the mascara in here? I think the mascara is in here. So I've obviously already tried the mascara and I love it. So in this set, you're gonna get a mini soft pinch liquid blush in the shade Joy, which I've been wanting to try the liquid blush out. Um, there's also a mini positive light liquid luminizer in the shade Mesmerize. I have not tried the liquid highlighter yet. There is a mini lip souffle matte lip cream in the shade Inspire. Haven't tried that either. And then of course there is a mini size of the mascara, which that is no problem for me. I'm always up for having a mini size of my favorite mascara on backup. This is definitely something that I will be purchasing. I'm hoping it doesn't sell out from now until then because it really is a nice pack up of some of the best selling items in the Rare Beauty line. Now I have another mascara. This is actually a brand new mascara and it is from the brand Say. I have reviewed I've done like a full face of Say Beauty on my channel. I'll have it linked up above in case you want to check it out. Um, but I enjoyed all of those products and I still reach for those products, especially the Say Cream Bronzer. That one is pretty amazing. They also have a good liquid highlighter, which I have been reaching for surprisingly so because I usually don't go for liquid highlighters. They came out with a new mascara. This is their uh, Mascara 101 Lengthening and Lifting. And the mini size retails for 13 bucks. I don't mind buying mini size makeup. In fact, I prefer to buy mini size makeup just because I try so much makeup. And let's be honest guys, I'll never have a chance to finish all of these makeup products that I buy uh, before they expire. I mean, that's just the way it is here on YouTube. You buy so much to review and then um, either you have to give it away or you have to use it or you end up discarding it because it goes bad, unfortunately. So anytime that I can pick up a mini version of a product that I need to review, sign me up. Next is another retinol. And I don't know that I'm gonna buy this. I'm looking at it. I know for sure I'm gonna get the Inky List one, but um, this one from Paula's Choice. This is the Clinical 1% Retinol Treatment. It retails for $58. You do get one ounce. That's a pretty fair price point for uh, the kind of brand that Paula's Choice is. I do enjoy Paula's Choice skincare products. I think they're really effective. I think they're, they're really good, they work. Um, so I might be getting this and, and the reason why is because I've already finished up my Drunk Elephant A Passioni uh, Retinol so 
It actually might be a toss up between the two. I might get the Drunk Elephant. They did repackage that retinol. Um, or I might try this one. They're both almost around the same price point. So I don't know. If you've tried this one, let me know how your skin reacted to it. Because sometimes my skin does have a reaction to retinol if it's too strong. This seems pretty, pretty standard 1%. I'm used to using that percentage, but you just never know. Next is another version of a retinol. This one is from the ordinary this is the grand active retinoid 2% emulsion it is less than 10 bucks it's affordable I'm willing to try it I've never tried this one this is just another retinol type of product that's going to help with anti-aging it does say it's good for all skin types including sensitive skin and it says it's going to help reduce the visible signs of aging without irritation so it might be that I skip out on the Paula's Choice altogether and just go with the Ordinary and with the Inky List. I might do that just to save a little bit of money. Uh, we'll see. Next on my list is from Glow Recipe. This is a product I love and now they made a jumbo size. This is a Plum Plump Hyaluronic Acid Serum. It retails for $60 and you get 2.02 ounces. I am a huge fan of Glow Recipe. This is one of my favorite skincare brands. I love their products. They all seem to work for me really well. I have yet to have a bad experience with Glow Recipe. Um, I've used this up already. It was in my recent Beauty Empties video um, and I had the regular size. So I think I'm going to go for this one just because I know I'm going to use it and I know I'm going to use it on an everyday basis. Next is another Charlotte Tilbury product. Product. This is a skincare. I love her magic cream. I love it. It's a fantastic moisturizer. I've been without it for a few months now. Um, it's an expensive one. It retails for a hundred bucks. This particular set is hundred and ten dollars, but it's only because you're getting the large size of the magic cream, which I believe is the 1.7 ounce size. No, the 1.6 ounce size. And then you get a point 27 ounce size of the magic serum crystal elixir which i have yet to try that so being that i can get this at a 20 percent discount this might be my splurge uh in the basket we'll see i really do love that moisturizer though it is fantastic day or night it works well under makeup it works well as you know your nighttime moisturizer it's extremely hydrating without being greasy or causing excess oiliness or anything like that it's just she did a really good job with that one. And finally in my cart is from Biosense. This is a product I'm pretty much certain I'm gonna be picking up just because I need a cleansing oil. I've already run out of my ColourPop one and I don't think I'm gonna be placing a ColourPop order anytime soon. So I need to get something ASAP. This is the Squalene and Antioxidant Cleansing Oil. I do a double cleanse every night regardless of whether I'm wearing makeup or not, but also because I do wear sunscreen and you do need something to break up the sunscreen just to get it all off of your face. Um, this seems pretty interesting. It's for $30. You get 6.8 ounces of product, which I think it's a very fair price. Again, for the type of brand and for this being at Sephora, I think it's, it's priced accordingly. Um, this also says that it is good for dryness. It's alcohol free, cruelty free, clean, no parabens. Um, it's pretty much good for all skin types and and I do need it. So I'm either going to get this one or the Josie Marin one because I have been looking at the Josie Marin one and I love Josie Marin skincare. It's just that I haven't tried Biosense before. So I think I think I want to add them to my stash and now seems like a pretty good time to do it. All right, so now I'm gonna talk about gift sets. Gift sets that I think are worth checking out. And the first one is gonna be from Glow Recipe. I've already told you this is one of my favorite skincare brands. And this is the Fruit Babies Best Seller Kit. It retails for $32. And you're getting five of their best selling items. So what you're getting is the uh, Blueberry Bounce Gentle Cleanser. You're getting the Watermelon Glow Pore Tight Toner. I love that toner. You're getting 
the Avocado Melt Retinol Eye Mask. That's a good one too. That's a sleeping mask. You're also going to get the Watermelon Glow Pink Juice Moisturizer. I have that one too. That's great if you have oily skin. And then you're also going to get the Watermelon Glow Sleeping Mask, which I am just about out of that one. I really enjoyed it. But this is a great way to try the brand at a very affordable price point. Next is from another one of my favorite brands, and that is Sol de Janeiro. This is the Galaxy Gorgeous set. I have my eye on this one too, but I just don't know if I can afford it right now. This one you're going to be getting for, again, best-selling items. This set includes the eight ounce size of the bum bum cream which is one of my all-time favorites it just smells amazing you're getting a three ounce size of the foreplay moisturizing shower gel which I am out of the shower gel. I might just end up purchasing the full size of the shower gel. I do have bum bum cream, so I'm good on that. I have never tried their bum bum body scrub. You get a 2.64 ounce size of that in this box. So I like that they're including that. And then you also get a three ounce size of the Brazilian Crush Cheriosa 62. That is the bum bum hair and body fragrance mist. I have a couple of those mists already so I'm good. But if you have somebody in your life that loves this brand, this is an amazing set to pick up. Um, I have picked up some of their holiday sets in the past. I still have their boxes. I use them at work. I take them to work and I use them over there. Um, but this is nice. Like the shower gel, the cream, the spray. I'm sure the scrub is fantastic. This would make a really nice gift for the holidays. Now another set that really caught my attention was from Benefit. And this is the Mascara Mixer full size mascara set that retails for $40. This is a bargain considering that Benefit mascaras, they usually retail for about $25 or $26 a piece. And these are all amazing mascaras. I think the only one I am out of is the Roller Lash, but I've used all three and they're fantastic. The bad gal bang you're gonna get some major length to your lashes with that mascara you're gonna get amazing separation with the roller lash and then you're gonna get a lot of definition with the real mascara i love all three of these like this is really nice if i needed mascara i would definitely be picking this one up next is from amika and this is hair care this is the bust your brass purple blonde maintenance wash treat and style set i have used all four of these products. I actually have all four of these products and they work amazingly well. They also have a set like this for non-blondes out there, but if you have platinum hair, if you have blonde hair, you know the importance of implementing a purple shampoo into your weekly routine. Um, Amika is a fantastic brand. These smell great. I mean, they work and they smell fantastic. Um, in this set, you're getting, of course, the shampoo you're getting the conditioner, you're getting the Bust Your Brass Intense Repair Hair Mask. That is fantastic. Use that once a week and it's it's just great. And then you're getting the uh, Perk Up Dry Shampoo, which that dry shampoo gives you a lot of volume and it just really brings the color back to life. Guys, I've always had a good experience with Amika hair care products and this set looks really fantastic for 29 bucks. And then finally, the Bite Beauty Millennial Pinks Four Piece Mini Power Move Creamy Matte Lip Crayon Set. This is a set of four and you do get the little pink tin. I've used these Bite Beauty matte lip crayons before. I don't think I have any of these shades though, but they're really good. And I love the crayon style of applicator because it makes it easy to line and fill in. This is a really good product. You can break it up and give it as an individual gift, or you can give all four in that pink tin. But I think this is a really nice way to try out Bite Beauty if maybe you haven't already. It retails for $39 and each lip crayon is 0.8 grams of product. Now I'm Going to share with you guys some of my high-end makeup and or skincare recommendations. First up is from Natasha Denona. I think definitely check out the new Retro Palette. That is a beautiful palette. I have reviewed that already on my channel. I'll have it linked up above if you want to check that out. But this palette is stunning. It is a neutral palette, but it's still fun. It still makes a statement. If berry tones are not your thing, definitely check out the Glam 
if you haven't already. The Glam palette is beautiful, especially for the holidays. I don't think you can go wrong with either palette. They both retail for $65 and the quality is impeccable. Next is a brand new collection from Huda Beauty. And this is a Rose Quartz Holiday Vault. This retails for $125. You are getting the brand new Rose Quartz palette. You're getting a three-piece brush set and you are getting the lip gloss. Is it lip gloss or lip balm? It is a lip balm. It's an illuminating lip balm in Love Stone. I didn't pick up this palette just because, I mean, I have uh, like so many palettes that I've bought in recently. So I'm kind of just trying to take a bit of a breather. This also looked a little too like things I already have. I think it's a beautiful palette. I just, I just needed to skip out on it because again, I've bought in so much. But if this is your color story, if you like the Huda Beauty formula, which I think the formula is great, then this would make a beautiful gift for the holidays. Maybe you're gonna give it to somebody or maybe it's gonna be a to me, from me type of gift. Now I wanna say this is only available online and it does come with that zip around makeup bag. It's a beautiful palette guys and if I hadn't already bought in so many then I would definitely be reviewing this for you all but I know a lot of my favorite content creators they have reviewed this already so definitely go check those videos out if you want some reviews tutorials on the Rose Quartz palette from Huda Beauty. Next is from another one of my favorite skincare brands and that is Tatcha. This is the Purify Treat and Hydrate Trio I have, I think there's only one thing in here that I have not tried. This retails for $76 and in here you're getting the 1.7 ounce size of the rice wash, use that this morning. You get um, 1.7 ounce size of the dewy skin cream. I have the large dewy skin cream love it it's fantastic if that goes on sale or if they have that available i think they're only going to have it available on the tatcha website then i'll definitely pick up another one of those but i like that you're getting it in this set and then you also get a 0.34 ounce size of the dewy serum that is the only thing that i have not tried i've used tatcha for so long i just you know there it's always in my stash i i like the products i like the effect that they have on my skin they're again they're hydrated without being oily without making me greasy since I am a normal to oily skin type they just provide the right amount of hydration I've used eye creams I've used exfoliators I've used a cleansers I mean you name it I've tried it from Tatcha but that dewy cream is definitely one of my all-time favorite Tatcha products and I thought this was a nice way to try out the Tatcha brand next is from Gucci and this is their new Flora Gorgeous Gardenia Eau de Parfum gift set so this set contains a one ounce size of the perfume and a 2.5 ounce size of the rollerball perfume so you get a spray and a rollerball I have not tried this product but it's something I've had my eye on for the last few weeks I like that it has the gardenia scent because I love a white floral scent I love gardenia and jasmine I think this is something that I would love I do want to go in store to smell it though because again I've never tried it I don't even think I've received a sample of it but this looks like a really nice set Gucci of course is outrageously expensive but for $92 you're getting two different products and I like the packaging on it as well um, this is something that if I bought I would definitely want to buy it on sale so I don't know maybe I'll splurge on this but I definitely think this would make a beautiful gift if not for the holidays and maybe for an upcoming birthday or anniversary and then last on my list of more higher-end type of purchases is from it cosmetics and this is the 12 12 Days of Confidence Collection Advent Calendar. I want an Advent Calendar where they don't tell us what's inside. I want to be legitimately surprised. I don't want to have any spoilers. And I hope one of these years, one of my favorite brands releases an Advent Calendar where they don't tell us what's inside because I want to be surprised. This actually looks like a really good pack up for that IT Cosmetics lover in your life. It retails for $149, but there's a lot of good finds in here. You're going to get a 0.5 ounce size of the Confidence in a Cream Hydrating Moisturizer. I've used that in the past and it's really good. You get a 0.47 ounce size of the Confidence in Your Beauty Sleep Night Cream. 
you get a 0.17 ounce confidence in a cleanser hydrating cleansing serum a 0.3 ounce of the superhero volumizing mascara i have that one it's a pretty good mascara you get a 0.09 ounce of the pillow lips solid serum lip gloss you get a 0.17 ounce size of the lash blowout mascara which i've been wanting to try that mascara that sounds pretty good you get a one ounce size of the your skin a better setting spray that is also something that's been on my list to try and then you get a really good foundation brush this is one I have it's fantastic it is the heavenly luxe complexion perfection brush number seven and you also get a mini powder brush that's a lot of product a lot of product for under $150. I mean, who wouldn't love to receive an advent calendar? And from It Cosmetics, you guys know the products are gonna be really good. I think if you have somebody in your life that just loves It Cosmetics, this is definitely something you might wanna consider getting for them. And finally, I'm gonna give you guys my top five products, $25 and under. Let's start first with the new Natasha Denona Mini Metropolis Palette. This retails for $25 and you are going to get a brush, which I have the brush here in front of me. I think the palette is over there behind me. This was a nice palette. I did a video where I created four looks with this little five pan palette. It was awesome. I've used it a few times since that video. I've also been using the brush. She usually never includes a brush with any of her palettes, but I like that she did it for this holiday season. Guys, this would make a great gift for maybe a coworker, maybe a stocking stuffer, maybe a birthday that falls from now until Christmas, or just a straight up Christmas gift. Who wouldn't want to see Natasha Denona under their Christmas tree or in their stocking? I know I would. Next is from Fenty, and this is the Resting Peach Face Cream Blush and Mini Gloss Balm Cream Duo. I believe this is a new shade, and this caught my eye just because I do like the cream blush, and I, of course, I love the gloss balm formula, and I like, again, mini makeup sizes. This is definitely something I can see myself picking up, but this is also something that would make a great gift. Fenty is loved by so many people. I know whoever you would give this to would be completely excited, completely grateful, and would happily welcome it into their stash. Next up is from Makeup Eraser, the original Makeup Eraser. And guys, here's mine right here. I just used it day before yesterday. I forgot to throw it in the wash a while ago, but I don't know where I would be without these things. When I do four looks, five looks using one palette, most of the time I'm doing all of those looks in the same day. This helps me out so much. This little pack up that they have, this is the Tropic Like It's Hot 7 Day Makeup Eraser Set and it retails for 25 bucks. I love that palm print. That is one of my favorite prints, especially for the summer, but definitely I would use that year round. You're getting seven reusable ultra soft cloths that will erase makeup with just water. And that's exactly what it does. Sometimes I do go in with like a cleansing balm and then I do use a damp makeup eraser to wipe it away, especially if it's like waterproof makeup, like eyeliner or mascara. But for the most part, guys, all you need is water and it does remove the makeup. I think this is a really cute set, especially if you have somebody who just loves to do their eye makeup. These little rounds are the perfect size for removing that eye makeup and I love the print. I think it's a great idea. It's a great gift to pick up for the makeup lover in your life. Another item from Say Beauty and this is their mini bestseller set. This retails for $25 and this set includes a 0.51 ounce size of the Glowy Super Gel, which that is fantastic. I've really been enjoying that one. It's in the shade star glow you're getting a 0.18 ounce size of the mascara 101 which i think i'm going to be picking up the mini version of that come friday and then you get a 0.41 ounce size of the liquid lip balm i've really been enjoying this brand guys if you've never tried it before this seems like a really great place to start, a really affordable place to start. And those are some cute little items to add to your stash. And last on my list of $25 and under items to try is from Buxom. And this is the In The Spotlight Plumping Lip Gloss Set. I have a couple of these minis and I do love them. They are really lip 
plumping. For 25 bucks, you're gonna be getting four different shades. The first shade is uh, called Celeste, which is a peachy beige sparkle. And then you're getting the shade Sugar, which is a pinky nude beige with opal shimmer. Also included is the shade Dolly, which is a true mauve. And then lastly, the shade Rose Julep, which is a rose berry. I like Buxom. I'm slowly starting to add more Buxom products to my stash. I think this would be a great little gift or a nice stocking stuffer for the holidays. All right guys, so that wraps up today's video. Hopefully I was able to give you guys some ideas, some suggestions on what to pick up during the Sephora holiday event sale. Once again, the sale starts Friday, November the 5th for Rouge members and it ends on Monday, November the 15th. Be sure to check the description box of this video for links to all of the products mentioned as well as dates as when your membership tier is able to shop and what percentage off you can expect to receive. So let me know your thoughts guys. What did you think about all of my recommendations? What do you think about some of the items I have in my cart? What are you going to be shopping for? Leave it in the comments down below. I want to thank you guys so much for watching another one of my videos. You all have a great day or night wherever it is you all are at. Stay hydrated, guys. Drink that water. And I will see you all very soon. Bye.